Hello, everybody. Welcome to Scotty's Side. Thank you for joining me today. I really, really appreciate it. We got a video here um, about when a man is not fully committed. Let's uh, let me move this here just a little bit centered. There we go. Okay. Let's see what she has to say. I'm gonna let the whole thing run. When the man is not fully committed, he will not take responsibility for the woman in a way that will make her feel covered for, provided for, protected, and cherished, safe. and adored, yes. and safe. Oh, Therefore, as a result of that, because he's the leader, she then will become more and more independent, which means you do not have a submissive woman anymore, Absolutely. which means I am also in self-preservation <laughs> mode because I'm not safe. I don't know if you're going to take yes. care of me. I don't know if you've got one foot <laughs> out the door. I don't know why you're not signing the papers or giving me the title or doing whatever. Oh, to me, all I know is you aren't sure about me. So if you're not sure about me, I'm not, I'm not sure about you. Yeah. But now, then we I'm become kidding. the problem. Okay, well, <laughs> there was a lot to unpack there. Let's, uh, oh boy, yeah, I got some thoughts on this. All right, let's, let's roll it back here. Man is not fully committed. He will not take responsibility for mm. the woman in a way that will make her feel covered for, provided for, protected. Yeah, okay, so right off the bat here, it's how she feels. My, my fee wings. It's my feels. She's not stepping back and thinking about this. If, I mean, look, if he's not doing these things for you and you're in a serious relationship, like, why would you not pull away and bring it up like a fucking adult? Like, why would you not say something? Especially if this is like supposed to be a committed relationship. Communication is key, right, ladies? You always harp on about that. Like, and why wouldn't you talk and about safe. it? Oh, Therefore, a as a result of that, because he's the leader, she then will become more and oh. more independent, which means you do not have a submissive woman anymore. Is being independent, is that what women really want? I know, you know, they go off about it all day, every day, about I'm so independent, I'm strong and independent, stunning and brave, all that stuff, you know, it's, I, but is it really what they're looking for? You know, I don't, this is, I don't know, this doesn't make any sense. Go back, go back. Dependent, which means you do not have a submissive woman anymore. So now, instead of talking about it and bringing it up, now you're going to be combative. More. That's what right. Which means I am also in self-preservation <laughs> mode. Right, so you're going to get snippy and shitty instead of being an adult and talking about it. You know? Because I'm not yeah. safe. I don't know if you're going to take yes. care of me. I don't know if I'm safe and take care of you. Oh, I thought you were independent. I thought you were all strong, independent boss babes. So now you're not going to be submissive. You don't feel safe. Why aren't you talking about it? And I don't know. Stupid bitch. Yes. <laughs> These other chicks are like, yeah, you go, girl. You queen. You got one foot out the Slay door. queen. No Good. Then you're not go. signing the papers or giving me the title. Or uh, Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait. If he's not that invested, uh... Like, why would he put you on any kind of agreements or like leases or car car notes or something like that? That would be that's stupid of the guy to do that. It's foolish. You know, I get this, look at this fucking look on her face. <laughs> I love it. That's dumb from a guy's perspective. You're talking about how you're not super serious, you're not fully committed, but you want him to put your name on all this shit. So. Yeah, and look, I'm assuming she's talking about a more committed thing, which is why she's even bringing it up. But look, bitch, if <laughs> I'm talking to her, if like if you're not sure about each other, there's a deeper there's a deeper problem here. Like, again, you fuckers need to sit down and talk about it. 
you know, it... doing whatever. To me, all I know is you aren't sure about me. So if you're not sure about me, yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure about you. Yeah, but now, then we become the, the problem. <laughs> It's it's not so much that you're the problem. I think it's just, I think it's a deeper bias towards men in general. You know, if it's, if it's like a marriage or, or even just like living together, um, if you, if you know, lady, these bitches don't understand that if, if they want to leave because they get bored or they're unsure or whatever, he's going to have to pay. And he's going to have to pay hard. This is why more men are walking away. They're not living with women. They're not getting married to women. It's because, yeah, if you think, oh, I want to leave. I, I'm bored. The grass is always greener, right? You know, it's, it's just not worth the risk for us. It's completely dumb for a guy to do this. Especially if he's got... If he's not a hundred percent sure, and then you act like this, and then and you you can't fucking come to him and talk to him about it, this is so immature, dude. This is so fucking childish. This is what I'm talking about, man. This is, oh God, women like this are just so. This is uh, I can tell she's an emotionally abusive piece of shit. She, and she's manipulative. I, I, I guarantee you all three of these bitches are manipulative, in my opinion. Just from this 45-second clip, I think they are. Yeah, no, it's just, it's not worth it for a guy to get, any, to get into any kind of serious thing like this anymore. It's so hostile towards men, and bitches are so flighty and can just leave and then take half of his stuff. So, nope. We're not going to do it, and you're just going to have to fucking learn to live with it, ladies. Sorry. Uh, sorry, not sorry. There you go. Guys, let me know what you think in the comments below. I'd really appreciate that. Leave a like, share, and subscribe, all that stuff. I love you all. Take care of each other. Take care of yourselves. Watch out for biatches like this. See you in the next one. Bye.